everybody. I hope you're all doing well. I just want to take a minute tonight to um, talk about some of the uh, head work we're doing down here at uh, Westside Machine. Um, so Steve has designed uh, several ports for LS Head, LS Threes, Cathedral ports, BR7, Brodex, um, and we program them all into our uh, Centroid uh, CNC machine. And then uh, we've got some really good programs with our new end Contour BB that Ryan does the valve job. So we're kind of offering packages where we do the CNC with your head, factory head, um, like an 821, 823 casting, um, or the Cathedral Port castings. We, I think we got almost all of them now. And we're not copying anybody else's head design or anything. We're designing our own port, programming it, digitizing it, and then making a CNC program for that. And then Ryan develops um, a seat program in the new one. So we do a surf or well, we do the CNC valve job and a surface as a package deal um, so to speak but anyways I wanted to show you some some of the numbers and things so here's um, an 821 and an 823 casting um, so this one just got cut hasn't been surfaced yet and you'll see with core shift in that they don't completely clean up and you don't want to just dig at that because one, you don't want to make them too big and two, you're just trying to, you know, the other thing you're trying to do is get all the ports consistent. So, um, but you can see, hopefully you can see in there, our step over is, uh, we take a little bit more time CNC in than some other companies that do big step overs. Um, we do a pretty, I mean, it's still a nice for the turbulent air and that, but it's not super rough. And we do a finer step over in the combustion chamber, as you can see. And we do a pretty fine step over in the exhaust, um, a real fine in this exhaust to get it somewhat polished. So that one's still dirty. It just got cut. And then um, you can see in the valve job here, um, he's got just a touch to blend there, um, but he does a full contoured radius on the exhaust. And then depending on the seat, um, that's a four angle valve job. Most of these will be a four angle valve job. Um, here's a head ready to go in and this will show you a little bit more of see the little bit of core shift in the combustion chamber of where it doesn't quite get it all but the step over is really nice um, on the intake you'll see that it gets almost all of it um, it does really well and then here on the exhaust you can see the little dark spots are where it doesn't quite cut all the material out um, from core shift from head to head anyways um, and here is a really nice you will see that the floor is not cut hardly at all because you're working at a different thing and you don't want to make them too big but uh, really nice job on the cathedral port and the combustion chamber and the exhaust here sorry anywho um, I'll give you some flow numbers but remember it so when we're talking about flow numbers, we'll be talking about like the 821, 823 head, um, an LS3 style head. We're just apples to apples. So like what we flow everything on our bench stock and then we do our changes and then we digitize it and then we see what improvements we made or where we may have need to make more improvements or whatnot. So I'm not gonna compare our flow numbers to a different bench because they're it's kind of like a dyno. They're all a little bit different. But anyways, when we flowed a stock GM LS3 head, so an 821, 823 casting, um, at 600 inches of lift, they were 292. At seven, 283. Um, at 800, they picked back up to 285. And say like at 500 inches of lift, 278. So where we're at with that is at 500 inches of lift, we're at 310, we're at 351 at six, we're at 375 at seven, and we're at 386 at 750. Um, so on a street hydraulic roller, that's about as far as you can go. Um, they work really well um, for, a, I mean, it's a really economical way to go to not have to buy an aftermarket head. Um, we can port these, surface them, do the valve job, um, and it's a pretty reasonable price. Give us a call um, down at West Side. Um, on the Cathedral Port head, that uh, 317 casting with the small um, CC chamber, um, that thing we've got that up to, at 600 inches left is flowing 310 and uh, 291 at 500 inches of lift. So. Um, if it's interested or you guys think it's cool, give us a shout. And uh, if we can answer any questions, just give us a holler. Thanks.